All right, you want to know a funny story? When I said I was going to cut it, I realized I was at my time limit, so uh, yeah, I ended the part there. But hey, guess what? I also made a realization. I need to explode that. But I was like, I don't have any bombs. So you know what? Through all my trials and tribulations, I realized all I had to do was just, you know, climb the bridge, and there, lo and behold, we're bombs. So, you know, answer to two of my problems. One, I need Yorda, and two, I need a bomb. So, I, f I figured it out. Pretty simple puzzle, just uh, was not insightful enough. That said, I need, to, I need to light my torch. Because as much as I love having the, uh, the bomb, it's going to be pretty useless unless, you know, I can, I can light it. Did, did I even light it? I, I didn't even light it. That was failure on everyone's part, including mine, especially mine. I, I, I didn't light it again. See, my problem is, I know I need to light it, and it's a fairly simple process. I'm just, what am I doing wrong? Can I, can I at least be given that? Whoa. Okay, I had to angle it. It was useless otherwise. Yeah, okay, there we go. That was a fairly simple procedure. Now, the next thing I need to do, and this is super crucial, is I need to grab my sword. I just left it right over here. And that's really all that you missed in the cut between me and trying to figure out what to do next. Uh, well, that and also figuring out I can't, I can't leave behind Yorda. Uh, at least not too far. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to traverse this all the way down. I'm going to grab her, and then I'm going to get all the way back up there via the uh, waterfall. I shut off. Because, you know, that, that's what's going to happen. So I'm going to spare you guys and cut it right now. Alright, and now we are back. I resumed it. I figured you didn't need to see me traversing the... Uh, the dry uphill slope that no longer has running water down it because you know kind of pointless kind of just like hey it's pretty simple oh yeah now we have these things i i don't know if i need yorda in order to have these things spawn but at the same time I, if it's anything like the last gate we're gonna have like some towel yeah there they are there's statue things we need yorda in order to like uh, have these get move out of the way we need her to move those out of the way i'm having trouble talking in this video but that's fine i don't even care man it's all good that's the lift okay i don't need to use the lift yet because as we all know there is a lever right here and this lever is the most important one because it's gonna have light reflect through everything and if any indication is uh, what was to happen in the last last tower oh that was all instant I like that she was even on the lift and everything this is fantastic this is going well okay uh, I, I'm a little excited now I'm, I'm pretty excited uh, I need I need the plank obviously because uh, you know I'm gonna have to like those I'm gonna have to do that but if it's any indication we're gonna have light revealed through this next entire part the only problem is uh, I have a feeling we're gonna have to move the little reflector thing that I tried moving the last uh, in the last tower but it did not did not move because it was stationed exactly where it needed to be all right this should let the light shine in and it should create some sort of shiny beam thing and it did now the question is, uh, what have I done? Did I do what I needed to do? <laughs> do I need to cut to the uh, movable tower thing? Is that is that what's left? Movable tower? I want my sword. I want my sword. Sorry, Yorda. I gotta go solo so I can grab my sword. I'm a little quicker by myself going solo. Alright, is that my sword? That is my sword. Oh, fantastic. Even if it's not, I mean, it's, it looks like it. It acts like it. Uh, as far as I know, these things don't break. It does a plank. It's very resilient wood. 
Uh, I don't care. Not important. No one cares about that stuff. What I care about and what you probably care about is trying to get that little reflector tower, whatever. I don't even know. I need I need the cutscene. I need the cutscene where we open up the gate. You know, the gate that everyone's talking about. I don't want to travel without Yorda because you know she's going to get kidnapped. And you know it's going to be tragic for everyone involved, including you guys. Especially you guys. It's just gonna make me look stupid. So, in order to make sure she's safe, she's traveling with me. It might be needless and pointless and, and no one cares, but I care enough to not want to get a game over. So, I'm sorry. You guys will have to bear with that. You probably already know the drill. I'm probably just reiterating the same thing I've said over and over this entire Let's Play. But you know what? We're making progress, and by God, I plan on finishing this game soon, and I'm going to be happy when I do. Okay, this thing, this thing, let's see. Well, I figure I need to move it, because as far as I know, I got everything going. I got everything working. The only problem is, what what is really happening? Is this the only missing piece? Is there, an, is there another piece I am not seeing here? That is not the right button I need to press. I didn't want to press the hand-holding button. I wanted to press the uh, moving the thing button. I got a question. Is this going to lock into place when I have it right? I like how the game immediately answered my question. <laughs> also, the Westgate. This is fantastic. Oh man. Okay. So yeah, I had a question. It was it was like, is this thing gonna is it gonna do the thing? Also, she can traverse that. That's that's beautiful. She's completely helpful. Um, I do not see I do not see her. Not one bit. Uh. Can I grab her? Cause you know she's like she's literally right here. You know she's she's right there. I should be able to like lift her up. I thought she was gonna be able to do this completely on her own, but I guess I guess the game doesn't want to acknowledge that. So I I guess I have to travel with her. I have to I, yeah I have to do that. Okay, but either way, I'm excited because we finished the West Gate. I got the trophy and everything to prove it. So uh, you know, it's, it's happened. We uh, we got the gate open. I can't wait to see what happens. I need her to get up this ladder. Oh, all this rides on whether or not she will do what I need her to do. Also, you know what's gonna happen, right? You know I gotta I gotta climb that one area and then like release the gate. That's also gonna be important. But the neat thing to all this is I know exactly where I need to go. I know what I need to do. Uh, there's no mystery behind it. So I, I'm I'm happy. We're getting to new territory. We're we're traveling uncharted waters. Also, there we go. That that's what I wanted to do. I need her to get down here. I need her to, you know, use the ladder. I guess we could have gone out that way, but eh, it, it doesn't really matter much that much to me. What what I care about is that, you know, she moves it, and then I grab her hand, and then we leave. We never look back, because it's happening. Everything's happening. It's so exciting. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't even need to deal with that upper ledge. I guess that's if you choose to exit via the hole. Uh, that, that would make the most sense to me. What also makes the most sense to me is, oh, wait, never mind. I was going to look down and be like, you know, that, but that's not the courtyard. That's just a, that's just a cliff that leads to nothing except, you know, death and water. Uh, willing to bet you would die upon impact. I, I could be wrong, but eh, I'm, I'm going to say you probably die upon impact. Also, 
Ah, that's what I was thinking. You see this, this little courtyard with glowing gates. I was thinking that was where that was, but, you know. I'm, I'm just, what the? That's just a shadow. Yeah, that's just a shadow. For some reason, I was thinking, um, that was a shadowy guy, because the angle was a little weird and looked kind of like a hulking, uh, entity of sorts. I was wrong. But that's okay. Now, if any indication is that this is like last time, I just need to go over here, press a lever, like so. And, like so. You want to... Do I have to go on the other... No. No, she's getting kidnapped! Oh my god, okay. I need to, I need to do this real quick, real fast. I got that. Alright, we do the thing. I need to leave. I need to leave. Oh my god, I, I love Gorda, and she's getting kidnapped. That's what that notification was. That was what that thing was. Oh man, come on, get out of that. And I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go. Ah, uh, every second I waste is a second she's dying. And by dying, I mean getting kidnapped. By getting kidnapped, oh no, 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 no. I gotta, I gotta go. I would drop down, but I'd probably die. Oh man, please do. You know what? Screw it. Drop down. Oh man, did I save her? <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm just, I, I, I'm having a, uh, I'm having, I'm hyperventilating just a little bit. I, okay, these guys aren't even dicking around. They're, that guy looks incredibly humanoid. That shape is incre- Okay. Seriously. I just- I need to catch my breath. I, I got super excited to the point where I'm just like, What the hell is going on? I'm hyperventilating. <laughs> you- You would do that, wouldn't you? See, that's what happens. You get too far away, they take her. And you don't get her back. It's the saddest and most traumatic thing I've ever had to experience. Because, you know, I, I care about Yorda. She, she's my bae. I need her as close by as possible. And I do not want to let go of her hand. I don't. I thought I could go... Why, why, why am I, uh... Why am I... Why am I... Why am I, ugh, I can't even talk. I'm trying to think of words. I, I'm just really flustered. My mind is trying to come up with words and it's failing. Oh... Uh, what I was saying is, I want to hold her hand as much as possible, at least until I finish the game, because, you know, I don't want to let go. The closer she is to me, the happier I'll be. Because it means she won't get kidnapped. And that's the important part right there. I think I'm also going to save. That would make the most sense to me. As the player. Because, uh, let let's be honest here. If I, if I save, I don't have to replay the rest of this. Also, you know, you want you want to join me on this couch? Yeah. All right, we're good. I was so nervous. I was so close. Every time she gets kidnapped, I don't recover. I don't get her back. She leaves me, and she's gone for good. It's so traumatic. It makes me sad every time. All right. Well, you know what? I think I'm gonna end it off here. This is probably a good part. Next time, we're gonna go investigate the the, the gate. You know, that glowing gate. We're gonna investigate that, because it's right... It's pretty much just a straight shot from here. So, it's it's gonna be pretty exciting. I'm not sure what to expect. I'm, I'm probably gonna get even more flustered and nervous and, and just scream at everyone because they're trying to take my bay away from me. And that is really a sad day for Gildum. Alright. See you next time.